Okay, here we are, Edgar. This must be the Egyptian part of the camp. It's, it's pretty nice, right? Well, yeah, I mean, it's not as nice as that, but it's still, it's, it's better than I expected it to be. It's, it's, it's quaint. Probably gonna go find the dorms here in a second, find our room. Oh, yeah, well, food? Yeah, yeah I, su I suppose you can go off looking for- Oh, okay, just, just don't wander too far! And no eating any people! In this world, we have been left behind by the gods. After the Titans fell, the children of Olympus returned to Camp Oasis to celebrate the Festival of the Pantheons, where other gods have stepped forward to make their mark. Greek, Egyptian, Asian, Oceanic, and Nordic Pantheons must now live together despite millennia of hostilities. Now their descendants seek to prove themselves and survive against a dangerous world of mythical beasts, monsters, and worse. Welcome to Origins of Olympus. I swear to God, he better not do anything stupid. Last thing we need is him drawing unnecessary attention to us. Well, anyway, I suppose I should find our room. I imagine it's somewhere in here. Do you gotta admit, this place is pretty nice. It's, uh, better than I expected it to be. Oh, this is cool. Oh, nice. That's, that is beautiful. Oh, I, I like this place a lot, actually. Um, okay, so that's the weapons room. We have, uh, Recaro's room. Don't know who that is. Uh, these ones are nobody's. Oh, I think I see my name up there. That must be my room. Suppose we'll check it out. Should hopefully be good enough for me and, uh, me and Edgar. Okay, looks like. There's already an occupant here. Interesting. Um, okay, well, I'm suppo I suppose I could talk to somebody and have it removed. Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm sure we'll find somebody. But, uh, I mean, aside from the skeleton strapped to the wall, uh, this should do. Hi, I'm Ricardo. Um, hi... Hi! Uh, yes, he he hello again. W w would you mind backing up, Ricaro? Uh, you're, you're a little uh, bit in my face. Sorry. Um, oh, so, uh, uh, it's good, uh, good, good to meet you. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm Mevidus. It's, it's good to meet you, Ricaro. Uh, what, what, I, I guess you're one of the, uh, Egyptians here at the camp? I'm a unicorn. Are you now? Oh, mm -hmm. Well, well, that's that's interesting. You, well, you know, books say that unicorns are one of a kind, so I'm a unicorn. Yeah, fair enough. I suppose I can't argue with that logic. Um, well, what what brings you to uh, Camp Oasis, Ricaro? The unicorn. Well, it's a long story. I'm from Mercury, and up there, uh, there was a Titan named Typhon who hit me. I went flying down to Earth. I crashed into a temple, and in the temple was a bald guy. And this bald guy was really nice, and he was sleeping for a long time. And then when we stepped out of the temple, there was this pit, and it grabbed me, and I went falling down into the underworld. There was hell, and there was a pit, and I was like, ow! But then I met a, a prince of the underworld. His name was Zylo. And then there was another prince of the underworld called Coleus. Those guys were stepbrothers. And there was an arena fight, and he like, Chopped off this guy's head, and then Hades was all like, You can go to Camp Oasis now. And he like put me in this box, and I was all like, I can feel it coming in the air tonight. Oh. And then I fell back, and then we all left, 
and then there was Miss Tiffany, and there was Miss Piffany, and there was a big portal, and uh, my brother Grug was there. He's a minotaur, and he was all like, Hello, I'm Grug. I'm not going to run in the meadows. And we had to say goodbye, and it was really sad. Then we went through the portal, and there was this tree thing, and I was all like, Hi, I'm Akaro. And he was all like, Huh. And I went flying. Ah! And then uh, Coleus, the, the other prince of the underworld, talked to it and was like, Hi, we're friends. You can let us pass. And he was all like, okay. And I was all like, ah! And I hit the ground. And then we hoppity skippity out of there. And we ended up at camp. And there was this woman. And there was a three-way hug. And then I was told to stay put. But then I saw a butterfly. And it brought me here. Okay, that is the, that is a very... I'm going to be in, uh, honest with you, Ricaro. I didn't catch half of that story. And I'm pretty sure you made like half of that up. But but it was a good story. I... I, I very good story. I love stories. I read stories all the time. When I was on Mercury, there was just things that came and appeared, like, you know, earth artifacts and relics and books. I read all about things. Oh, oh well, that's good. Not Knowledge is good. It's good to learn things. Mm-hmm. So, who are you? Oh, as I said, I'm a, a Mevidus. Um, my, my mother is a goddess named Circuit, and... Oh, I know her. Does that make you the Scorpion King? Oh, well, I, I suppose What's it does. A oh, a, a scorpion? It's, um, it's, it's, it's a creature. It has, like, some legs, and it has claws, and it has, like, a tail that can sting you with poison. You don't have a tail. Oh, well, yeah, yes, not, not right now. I Where's don't. your tail? Oh, uh, oh, well, okay. Well, first of all, if you once again, if you could just back it on up a little bit, you see. Um, you, sorry. You don't know about things like boundaries or personal space or anything like that, do you? What's that? Oh, well, well, Ricardo. Um, generally, if you get you know really close up into somebody's face, it tends to make people uncomfortable. So. Um, Oh, you probably don't. Sorry. Want to... Oh, oh, okay. Yes, you're you're doing it again, but it, it's fine. Oh. It's 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 a learning process, I suppose. Um, but yes, I can turn into a scorpion if I want to. I just oh, try do, do, do. not. Well, I, it's something I try not to do unless I absolutely have to. Hmm. Can I meet a scorpion? Uh, yeah, sure. I I mean. I have a friend who's also a scorpion. He's his name's Edgar, but uh Hi he, Edgar. Uh, well he's not here. He's he, but oh but good practice. You you can say that to him when you do get to meet him. He uh okay. ran off to go get some food. Oh food. It's probably nice? better food. that he's actually chicken nuggies? Oh well Maybe he found chicken nuggies. Up. Is it, I want chicken nuggies. The thing about Edgar is he will pretty much eat anything. In fact, it's probably good that he's not here. He's probably trying to eat you. But uh, that's besides fun. the point. Did you say fun? Mm-hmm. Fun. Um, I, I can assure you, Ricaro, getting eaten by a scorpion is probably not fun. If you say so, I believe you. You have a beard. That, yep, 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 that I do. Um, Very. So, um, it sounds like you just happened upon Camp Oasis just through a series of interesting events. You, uh, you didn't <laughs> plan to come here or anything? Nope. I thought I was going to be Mercury forever. I was trying to get to Earth, and I could never find a way. But then, Typhon yeeted me, and here I am. So now... I can finally do what I came to do. He, he, what, he did you? What is, what is he? I was like, I was here, and then he was like, pow! And I was like, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, are, you, are you okay, Ricardo? Uh-huh. Well, this is child's play compared to where I fell from. Oh, I, I suppose. Well. This guy, Coleus, he told me about fall. I relate to fall, because I fall a lot. I'm always falling. Oh, you mean... You mean fall the season? Uh huh. Fall the yeah. season. That's me. I am fall the season. I okay. That's. I'm pretty sure those are different types of fall. But, but, but it's good. It seems you're um, 
learning, I suppose, things. It's it must mm -hmm. be very exciting for you. What? What's and I met a goat. A, a goat. Okay. Uh huh. And uh, ooh, ooh, there was a horse and a pig and a butterfly. It was great. And crops. I love what crops were. Oh wow, you're you're learning all sorts of things. Well, good good for you, Ricardo. That's that's. I'm glad to hear that. What's this place? Oh well, this I believe is the dorms for the Egyptian pantheon. We this is this is where oh. the Egyptians sleep. Everybody has a room. This is where I'll be. Cool. Oh yeah, we're gonna be neighbors. Great. Uh, uh huh. But, um. Oh, yes. Um. Yeah, but I I believe it's um. Yeah, yeah, this is the Egyptian dorms. It seems to be inside a pyramid of some sort. A pyramid? This is a pyramid? That means that's a pyramid. Ooh, can I walk up it? Oh, no, no, no that, that's not an actual pyramid, Ricardo. That's a, that's a, um, that's a painting of a pyramid. Oh, what's a painting? Um, it's sort of like a picture. What's a picture? It's, um, it's like a painting. Actually, I, I don't really know how to explain. See, it's not like a real pyramid. It's somebody, you know, took paint, which is, you know, just like a liquid, and they and they used a brush, and they just made a, made a representation of a pyramid. Oh, did they burn it in with lava? I don't think that's how they did it, but, um, I, I do appreciate your imagination. Okay, well... That's cool. What about all this? What's this? Ooh, what's this? What's that? Oh, okay. Oh, well, all right. This seems to be a bar of some sort. They, these are plants. And, plants? Uh, Why are they green? I, I don't know. A lot of plants are green. It's a, I, Not I where wish I come I, from. Oh. Oh, what, what color are the plants where you come from? Well, the stems are made from, like, obsidian, and uh, the leaves glow. That sounds actually really, really nice. It, it must be beautiful. Mm-hmm. Mercury's beautiful. Reminds me of the underworld. Those guys are the same. Oh, uh... So, in, in, in your crazy whirlwind of a story there, you mentioned, uh, the underworld. You you were in the underworld? Uh-huh. I fell right through. Oh, you didn't, um, happen to run into Ammonius by any chance, did you? Ammonia who now? Uh, never mind. It's not important. It's, it's, it's probably for the best. Um, what if I ever do? I'll say hello. Yeah, you might want to avoid him if you do run into him. He's not, um, how should I put it? He's not exactly friendly. Oh, that's okay. The arena was full of unfriendly people, and I was like, Hi, I'm Rikara. Oh, and what did they say back? Nothing. Oh, that's, that's kind of rude, to be honest. I know, that's what I said, but, you know, some people. Yeah, some, some, some people indeed. Well, um... What's this? Oh, that's, uh, I believe that used to be a bear, and now it's a rug. This is comfy. Yeah, yeah, it is, it, it, it's, it's pretty, it's nice and soft. You know, the bear's fur is, is nice. Well, um, you know, I must say it was it was nice talking to you, Ricaro. I need I need to be going. Oh, okay. Oh, where where are you going? Where are we going? Oh, oh, we we um. <laughs> well, I, I I need to go find my friend Edgar. Edgar, yeah, let's do that. Oh, you wanted to come with me um yes. oh oh wait that that's a this I, I believe that's a bed um this is a so I, see I'm, I'm sorry I mean I know what some of these things are it's just uh you might not be asking the most knowledgeable person I might I might not have all the answers for you Ricardo I do apologize oh well Edgar um well, he has some answers, all right, but uh, it's kind of a pain. Um, anyway, a pain? um, somebody who's um, how should I put it? He's 
not exactly a pleasure to be around all the time. Oh, I've never met one of those. Yeah. I like everyone. Yeah, me neither. Um, oh, well, well you know, that, that's good, but you do need to be careful, Ricaro. You know, it's, it's, it's admirable What's to that? like ever. Oh. Oh, just give me you know, some goodbye, Mevidus. Oh, okay. Bye. Skip D. Skip D. Who was that guy? Okay, that was certainly interesting. Um, anyway, I wonder where Edgar ran off to. It's gotta be around. Oh, oh, there you are, buddy. Did you uh find some food? Oh, uh, are you serious? An, an entire cow? How how is that even possible? That's like four times the size of you. Okay, I suppose I'll just take your word for it. Well, um, good news. I found our room, and it's, um, nice-ish. There's, um, there may be a skeleton chain to the wall, but I'm sure we can speak to somebody and have it removed. Y yeah, yeah, I know, I agree. That's a, definitely a strange thing. We probably want to get that taken care of. Um, I also, uh, met somebody... Well, um, he's a bit, how should I put it? He's hard to explain. I don't really know what to make of him. Um, his name was Ricaro. He, yeah, yes, Ricaro. And he's, um, very strange. I just, uh, I honestly don't even know how to explain him to you. Uh, you'll, you'll see what I mean when you meet him, though. No, you can't eat him. He, I, I don't even know if he would taste very good. He's, he looks like he's not from here. Let's just say that. But I mean, either way, we should probably focus here. We're, we're not here to, you know, eat cows and meet weirdos. You know, we're, well, I guess we're kind of here to meet weirdos. We, as you know, we're here to find somebody. And the only way to do that is we're gonna have to m get out there and make friends. I I know. I I don't like it either. You you know how I feel about friends, but uh, you know it's just it's what we have to do. If we're ever gonna find this person, we're we're, we're gonna have to just meet people. No, no, meet people, not eat people. Look, look we're gonna, I'm, I'm gonna have to ask you to be on your best behavior. Can you please promise me that you're not gonna eat anybody? That's not exactly the answer I was looking for, Edgar. But promise me you'll behave yourself and not try to eat anyone. Thank you. Okay. You ready to do this? Alright, let's go.